Have you ever wondered about the intriguing facets of the 1965 classic film Dr. Zhivago? Perhaps you're curious about lesser known facts or anecdotes that add depth to the movie's history. Or maybe you have a favorite classic Hollywood actor from the cast that left a lasting impression. We'd love to hear your thoughts on that. Dr. Zhivago, directed by David Lean, is an epic romance set against the backdrop of the Russian Revolution. The film stars Omar Sharif in the titular role and Julie Christie as his love interest. While it's widely known for its sweeping cinematography and the timeless theme of love in the face of war, there are plenty of intriguing tidbits about the production and its cast that might surprise you. For instance, did you know that the film's iconic Ice Palace scenes were actually created using a mixture of marble dust and wax? And what about the classic Hollywood actors who appeared in supporting roles alongside Sharif and Christie? Who was your favorite among them? Now, as we delve into the world of Dr. Zhivago, we invite you to share your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this iconic movie. We'd love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Share your thoughts and let's explore the film's rich tapestry together. Dr. Zhivago is a 1965 epic romance film directed by David Lean, based on Boris Pasternak's novel. Set against the backdrop of the Russian Revolution and World War I, it tells the story of Dr. Yuri Zhivago, portrayed by Omar Sharif, a poet and physician who navigates the tumultuous events of his time. The film introduces Lara Antipova, played by Julie Christie, a woman who becomes the love of Zhivago's life, while Geraldine Chaplin portrays Tanya, his wife. The story revolves around their complex love triangle amidst the chaos and tragedy of war. The film's unique style is characterized by its sweeping cinematography, capturing the grandeur of the Russian landscape and its emotional depth. Morris Jarre's iconic score adds to the film's enduring impact, complementing the romantic and political themes. Dr. Zhivago is known for its exploration of personal and political struggles and its enduring themes of love, art, and the human spirit in the face of adversity. The film became a cultural phenomenon and remains a classic in cinematic history, winning five Academy Awards. It has left an indelible mark on popular culture, inspiring parodies, references in other works, and countless adaptations across various media. Dr. Zhivago continues to be celebrated for its timeless portrayal of love and resilience in the face of historical turmoil, making it a true cinematic masterpiece. Dr. Zhivago, the 1965 movie directed by David Lee, faced challenges during its production. The film's producer, Carlo Ponti, initially sought to shoot it in the Soviet Union, but the government denied permission. As a result, Lean had to explore alternative filming locations, including Yugoslavia and Scandinavia. However, these areas proved too cold, and Yugoslavia's bureaucratic obstacles were prohibitive. Despite these challenges, the movie was eventually shot in Spain during the regime of General Francisco Franco. An interesting incident occurred while filming a scene with a crowd chanting a Marxist theme at 3 a.m. The police, thinking a real revolution was happening, showed up on set and insisted on staying until the scene was completed. The secret police reportedly surveyed the crowd as extras sang the international for a protest scene, with many pretending not to know the words even though they had been rehearsed. Nearby residents, awakened by the singing, mistakenly believed that Franco had died or been overthrown, leading some to pop champagne bottles in celebration. These anecdotes offer a glimpse into the challenges and unique experiences faced during the making of Dr. Zhivago, a film that remains an enduring classic. In 1965, the movie Dr. Zhivago faced a slow start at the box office, with critics giving it a lukewarm reception. Despite a $1 million spent on publicity, the first three weeks' returns were disappointing. Director David Lean even remarked that you could hurl boulders in the theater and not hurt anyone. However, as time went on, the film gained popularity, likely thanks to the success of Morris Jar's Lara's theme. This musical piece became an iconic part of the movie. Directed by David Lean, Dr. Zhivago faced challenges in obtaining the right music for the film. Although Lean initially failed to secure the copyright for a suitable Russian theme, he turned to Morris Jar for help. After rejecting several submissions, Lean instructed Jar to take a weekend getaway with his girlfriend and return with a fitting theme. 
The result was Lara's theme, which became a defining element of the film's soundtrack. This love story set against the backdrop of the Russian Revolution eventually found its place in cinema history. It is a testament to how a film can overcome a rocky start to become a classic. The recreation of Moscow on a Spanish studio lot took 18 months to achieve. In the 1965 movie Dr. Zhivago, a remarkable feat of filmmaking was the recreation of Moscow. The production team transformed a Spanish studio lot into the Russian capital, a process that consumed a staggering 18 months. This extensive effort was crucial in bringing the epic story to life, with the recreated Moscow serving as a backdrop for the film's dramatic events. The meticulous attention to detail in replicating the city added authenticity to the movie, allowing viewers to immerse themselves in the world of Dr. Yuri Zhivago and his tumultuous journey through a war-torn Russia. The painstaking work that went into replicating Moscow's streets and architecture contributed significantly to the film's overall impact. This dedication to recreating historical settings was a testament to the commitment of the filmmakers in portraying Boris Pasternak's iconic novel on the big screen. It demonstrates the lengths to which the production team went to ensure that Dr. Zhivago captured the grandeur and realism of its setting, making it a timeless classic in cinematic history. In conclusion, the 18-month effort to recreate Moscow on a Spanish studio lot stands as a testament to the dedication of the filmmakers and the attention to detail in Dr. Zhivago, enriching the film's historical authenticity and overall impact. Dr. Zhivago is a 1965 film known for several interesting facts. One of these facts is that the movie was not shown in Russia until 1994. Despite its setting in Russia and being based on a Russian novel, the film faced a delay in reaching its home country. Another notable aspect of the film is that Geraldine Chaplin, who portrayed the character Tanya, modeled her performance on her mother, Una Chaplin. This family influence added a unique dimension to the movie. Additionally, despite its highly diverse international cast, Dr. Zhivago contains almost no Russian actors or actresses, or even those of Russian heritage. This casting choice has been a point of discussion over the years. These facts provide a glimpse into the history and casting of the iconic film Dr. Zhivago. It's a movie that has left a mark on cinema, even with its unique journey to Russia and intriguing casting decisions. As we bid adieu to this exploration of the 1965 cinematic masterpiece, Dr. Zhivago, I invite you to pause for a moment and let the echoes of this timeless tale reverberate in the chambers of your memory. This film, with its sweeping landscapes and captivating characters, has woven itself into the fabric of our cinematic history. But it's more than just celluloid, it's a reflection of human emotions, relationships, and the indomitable spirit of love, set against the backdrop of a tumultuous era. Perhaps you recall the haunting melodies of Morris Jarre's score resonating in your mind, or the soul-stirring performances of Omar Sharif and Julie Christie, which left an indelible mark on your heart. Maybe it's the snow-covered landscapes of Russia that transported you to a world of ethereal beauty, or the poignant love story that stirred your own emotions. In this digital age, we invite you to share your thoughts, memories, and reflections on Dr. Zhivago. Did it inspire your own quest for love in a tumultuous world? Did you discover a newfound appreciation for the power of art and literature? Or perhaps you simply relished the timeless beauty of the film's cinematography? Your voice and your unique connection to this cinematic masterpiece enrich our collective understanding of its impact. So, let your thoughts flow as we cherish the legacy of Dr. Zhivago together. Thank you for investing your time and interest in this journey. Your perspective is invaluable to us, and we hope that you continue to explore the realms of film, literature, and art that resonate with your soul. Until next time, this outro was...